Hi everyone! I finally received the second shipment from Toriba. Well, part of it, anyways. Supposed to be four boxes, but I've only received two so far. Um, are you ready for the second unboxing video? So I will just do one box this time, and you know, save some for later. Um, lately, I saw that a lot of people are playing this game. It might be due to the recent worldwide free shipping. It's a really fun game, but it's really, really addictive. So don't spend too much, guys. Anyways, um, I'm going to open up my second box. Second box open. So the first thing I see here is this um, Love Life cushion, uh, pillow, I suppose. Um, it's really, really cute. It looks very pretty. I don't know if you can see the flickering texture of this pillow. It's really, really well made. It's really soft as well. They have two designs, but I only managed to get one. Wanted to get the second one, but by the time I, you know, wanted to try, it's already out of stock. So only got this one. Oh, we get more of this Rilakkuma's fern. I remember its name this time, called Rilakkuma. So here we go. Oh, and a second one. Oh, we finally get the Rilakkuma itself. Let me open it up and show you. Okay, open up Rilakkuma. Ta-da! Remember, I, well, if you watched my first unboxing video, you probably remember last time I said the Korilakuma, this white stuff was a bit dirty. That made me quite disappointed. Now this one is very clean. Very clean. Same design, except, you know, this is Ridakuma, it's brown. The other one is white. So this is the back. The tag is the same as uh, Korila Kuma. Nothing special. Oh, and we have a second one here too. I think I got two Rila Kuma and three Korila Kuma. That's about right. So I open up another bag as you can see here. It's this purring dog. Look at how adorable it is. Just look at it. It's um not as um what do you call it not as fluffy as you would think but it's still very soft it's so it's so chubby just look at it it's so chubby there is another design where it's like walking sideways I got that one as well, but I guess it hasn't come yet. So that's the back. And it's Star Butts. If you remember what I'm talking about last time, I showed you the peering cup with the star at the back also. So the tag. Pom Pom Peering. With you always. It's another Sanrio character. The second one is the same. It's really cute. Just look at the design. It has that hat. Um, it's actually very huggable. Very squeezable. <laughs> Alright, so this one same as last time I show you. I show you the pink one. So it should be exactly the same except it's white. And then got another pink one. And 
and one more. This one is really cool too. This one, it's another pillow. It's the Disney Pixar. Volume 2, I think. Um, when Volume 1 was out, I haven't started playing. But this is really cute. It has some of the new characters. Sadness, Joy. I think this is the anger face or something. And this is the angry. Oh wait, sorry, that's the disgust. That's angry. Oh, and if you remember this, this was from Toy Story. Um, number three is the bear that has um, the scent. And of course, uh, Buzz Lightyear. Uh, this is the alien. Woody. Uh, what's her name? I somehow forgot now. Anyways. So, Finding Nemo, it's, it's really vacuum sealed, so I can't feel um, how soft it would be, but it seems like it's quite thick if you open it up. So the back, it has more figures. And the tag, Disney Pixar Saga. Okay, so the remainder in this box, it's a bag of goodies and some boxes. Let me open them up. Okay guys, so these are the remainder that you saw in the box. I sort of opened them up, so let's view one by one. Uh, start with this bag first. So I got a couple Winnie the Pooh. I don't know why this one looks kind of funny. I don't know what do you think. It looks hilarious. Um, it's same texture as the Pooh Dog. I think you're able to tell even from the video. Uh, those shiny textures. So it's not fluffy, but it's very soft. And very squishy. <laughs> uh, let's see who made this. Disney Sega. Okay, so that's the sitting version. Uh, same color, it has a Sleeping version, I guess. It's, it's, it looks really funny to me for some reason. So this is the uh, same tag as this one. I don't know, it looks really funny. Now, the actual Winnie the Pooh color, the yellow color, not the brown, got this too. They have four designs in total. I got four. The whole four of them. The tag is the same. Just a normal Disney tag. This one, the sitting orange version. Oh man, it's so squishable. It's not as squishy, but I don't know, I just want to squish it. Uh, then the next one is this Idol Master plush that you saw in my first unboxing video. I think she looks the best out of the three, to be honest. So it's nice, I got two of them. So if you've seen this one, I won't show you everything. So that's her. I think that's the last one in the bag. This one is the Pikachu. Ooh. Well, 
It's bigger than I thought it would be. I thought it would be you know, quite small. This is the size comparison. This was actually hard to get in the game. I was not gonna play this game because I saw many many people having trouble with it. But it just so happened that somebody left while it was almost falling down and I you know I could see there is a spot to poke it down. So then I got it. I don't think I spent too many tries. Um, but yeah, it has two designs too. It has the other, I think it was orange brownish coat, but I didn't get that one because I never saw it was, you know, in a good position for me to get like easily. Um, you can put the hood on the Pikachu as well. Let me show you. So this is what it looks like when the hood is on. I have no idea what it's called. I don't really watch Pokemon. I know Pikachu because it's famous. So yeah, that's that. It's really, really cute. Um, like a ball. And let's look at the tag. Oh, there we go. This is the other design. Rain shoe or something, I think. I'm not sure. No idea what they called. Cute. Right. So let me get the Winnie the Pooh out of the way. Got one of these. It's a tissue box cover. Cute, but I feel like it's a bit different than I imagined. This this doesn't really look like mini. It looks exactly the same except for bow. Well, I guess it has the eyelashes too. Anyway, it, it's it's quite cute. The material it's okay, not bad. I so I think um, they give you a box so you see how it kind of attached to a tissue but yeah it's the, these two can't stand up for some reason hopefully if I put it on an actual tissue box it will stand so it's Disney Sega as well then I got three boxes of this Gudetama. It's it's becoming my favorite character right now. I used to love Hello Kitty. Now I just love this lazy egg. Just look at it. So lazy. Then we got two more accessory trays. This one was kind of pro. Um, if you remember the first unboxing video because I thought it was a jewelry box it turned out to be a accessory tray I still don't know what I'm gonna do with it so this one is the pink as I showed you last time and I got a white one this time I will open it up and show you and then the last thing in this box is this face roller when I got it, I had no idea what it was. Um, I think this one is pink. I also get the black one lately because somehow they put it up again and it was such an, a great position that I just have to get it because it was almost falling down. So I will open up and show you. I have no idea what this is. As somebody have commented in my video before, like the winning video for this one, you kind of just want to get it just to see what it what it is, right? Anyway, let me open it up. Okay guys, I opened up the Mickey and Minnie accessory tray. To me, the white one looks, I don't know, when I saw it, I had like a wow. Um, feeling 
I think it looks more subtle than the pink. But now I pull them both out, they both look nice. But I still think the white one is more subtle. I guess maybe it gives you more of a wedding feel since you know the wedding dress would be in white most of the time. It's, I don't know actually. I had to pull this pink out to compare. I think they both look very nice even though you probably don't have much use for it but it's it's really pretty. The figure it's really well made. Anyway, so that's this. Haha, uh -huh, more to the Tama. No, but I will show you the Hello Kitty face roller first. So, this is the box. There's nothing on the side. teaches you how to use, I think. So you're supposed to get some paper. Um, uh, too bad, I don't know Japanese. I don't quite understand what it says. Maybe you guys can teach me. But I open it up and it's it's take a look guys it's way bigger than I thought it would be I don't know how you roll this on your face I don't get it let's see it seems like you can open this up what does it say at the back it says oh, Tokyo, Japan. Okay. So it has the paper that the box was talking about. But I'm not sure how you roll this on your face. And what do you do with it? I don't get it, guys. Maybe if you know, let me know. I have no clue what this thing is for and how to use it but it looks very cute look it looks very cute I like the Hello Kitty hmm okay I don't know I like it though even as an accessory, it's cute, right? <laughs> okay, now my favorite Gudetama. Gudetama. So let me show you the box first. This is a tote bag. It has two kinds. I only got this kind. I think you can tell that I really like this style. It looks, I don't know. I didn't like the other one. The other one is this one. But, you know, how can the words replace the actual Kudatama? Just look at him, he's so funny looking. Um, so, I kind of tell you a little bit about the details of the bag here. So, I open one up, and here it is. Look at it. It's actually very uh, good quality. Um, I don't know if you if you can still recall the last video I got some Hello Kitty tote bags. Um, the material is similar, but I think this one is better quality than the Hello Kitty one, and it's way cuter. Just look at look at all these lazy eggs. Just look at them. So that's back. A normal tote bag. It has a huge zipper. I like it. It's really um, like it's really smooth. So inside, it doesn't have any other inside pocket. Just a huge thing. But you know, it 
so cute as it is. So cute. As like a shopping bag, or maybe if I would say even if you go to school, like put some notes, you know your your other pens, your wallet, whatnot. It's it's sufficient. Um. So yeah, that's the end of this second box. A lot of goodies. Um. So like and subscribe and give me any comments if you have any. If you know how to use that roller, please do comment below and let me know. Um, because as I said, I got no idea. Um, and also a side note, as you probably noticed, I have been reposting. Um, my old videos because I noticed that there is a person named Toy Monster. He had, I don't know, somehow downloaded my videos and we posted them on his channel. Um, it's exactly the same as mine, and even the naming, he didn't change it because you know how I name my prizes by the number like by the order i got them and even those numbers are exactly the same so i know it was my videos um so now i put you know some wordings in the video and hopefully uh, people won't steal them anymore i have no idea why you would you know download them and post on your channel but that's not very nice so um, I'm sorry if I've been spamming a lot of old videos. Um, I just want to, you know, have them all done. Then I'll post some new videos um, to let you guys enjoy. I will also be making some uh, compilation compilation of um, the, you know, separate videos how I win a certain prize. So. Even though it's only a one side view, but you can at least, you know, get a rough idea what kind of position to poke or what kind of position to pick up something. I'm not, you know, that great at it, but, um, you know, I now get you know, some sort of idea, you know, where, how to get a prize. And, you know, if you after a couple of tries, you know that thing just won't move. I would say just give up, because chances are even if you're gonna get it, you will spend a lot of money. So, well, up to you. If you think it's worth it, then do it. If not, then I would say give up. Even if somebody you know get it later, that's okay. Just watch them, and you'll learn from them, right? Then next time you will get it and save yourself a lot of money. Um, anyways, I'm sorry for the long mini speech. I hope you enjoyed the unboxing video. I will be doing more. Uh, I still got one box at home. Uh, more are coming and I will continue to show you guys. Let me know if there are some stuff you want to see or things like that, I can try to post them earlier um, and show you guys. Alright? Okay, bye!